My name is Sergio Trindadi, and I work with uh, a company, a consulting company called SET International Limited. It works all over the world on energy, uh, environment, and technology. The project we've done in Bellagio with uh, 18 other people was uh, uh, biofuels, uh, sustainability of biofuels. There is uh, in the world a concern about fuels, a uh, concern about energy in general, uh, and biofuels is part of the answer. It doesn't provide the total answer, but it's part of the answer. And it's not fully understood. And I thought, we thought, that it would be good to have an opportunity to get uh, 18 brains uh, focused on the topic and finding out what are the facets of biofuels that need to be understood and explained to the rest of the world to, to understand. The uh, outcome is uh, uh, sort of a declaration in which we sort of uh, point out the major points that we wanted to uh, tell the world that uh, uh, would help them understand why it's so important to have biofuels in the energy mix and the fact that uh, this is a particular angle that uh, was important to this discussion which is uh, uh, because biofuels are the result of uh, biomass grown different places like uh, corn, sugarcane, and others. Uh, it is more natural that these uh, biomass be grown in areas where you have sunshine, water, and, and the land available. So, and it, it's not so natural to have them grown in the northern countries, and therefore one of the discussions we had was the idea of a bio-pact, a pact between north and south con southern countries, in which the northern countries will continue to produce their own biofuels, but if they need more biofuels, they should not expand in, in their own territories. And, and the southern countries, which are more uh, amenable to produce uh, biofuels, they have more photosynthesis uh, than the, the other parts of the world should perhaps uh, not only satisfy themselves but also export to the other countries. This of course requires uh, lots of uh, discussions, negotiations between countries. I was once uh, invited by the Ministry of Foreign Affairs of uh, Thailand since I was in Bangkok, more or less like since I am in New York I'm talking to you here. Uh, uh, to in the, the year is 2007 I believe that the year where grain prices went through the roof. And then I explained to the Thais, I said, look, the grains that really went to the roof were rice and, and wheat. <laughs> you don't make fuel ethanol from rice and very little from wheat. Therefore, there is no connection there. Even corn, uh, which is the base of uh, fuel ethanol in the United States, uh, the capacity of, of producing corn in the United States is so large that uh, it can satisfy the, the present demand at the time and uh, export to the other countries. So there is, uh, at that stage, the, uh, and when people were complaining, there was no reason. But there may be a reason if they continue to expand the uh, biofuels on the basis of food crops. That's why the future of biofuel lies in non-food crops such as cellulosic materials and even uh, plantations uh, of materials such as uh, jatropha, which is a, a little bush that uh, produces oil. And this oil is not edible because it's slightly poisonous. So you're right, it's important to move away from food uh, crops as a basis for uh, sugar, uh, for uh, biofuels. And, uh, but at the present time, it's still not a, not a problem. Now, Bellagio is a, is a beautiful place, as we all know. Uh, but beauty in itself, uh, you know, does not necessarily lead to good, to good thinking. You, you need a combination of uh, uh, place and, and, and minds. And uh, 
this is what makes the place magic. It's not its, its, it's uh, appearance. It's the fact that people who have brain and minds are there and have the opportunity to, uh, to stay together without much uh, distraction uh, and, and inspired by the environment. Uh, I think this is, uh, this is something Bellagio uh, uh, achieves very, very well. And in our case, definitely, um, I think the Rockefeller Foundation should be proud of uh, the role it plays in, in facilitating uh, these kinds of discussions in you know, a variety of, uh, of issues. And I, in our case, I can say that uh, uh, we, we got, uh, a, 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 in my view, an excellent outcome of that uh, discussion because we were together in, uh, in this sort of a magic place that Bellagio is.